Yeah. Right, set me up, set me up. <laughs> You're doing great so far. It's gonna need to be a little taller. That tripod's not just built for a guy your size, it's built for me. <laughs> No, you're ruining it. Not. Gotta drop the legs there, pal. I'll hit pause and help you, Heather. First of all, we're gonna go all the way to the other side of the football field. It's gonna be a lot easier to see Steven and Antoine, our radio man, behind a background that's not all green, a nice bright background. Plus, we're trying to hear the sound of the cymbals. And being behind the wall is gonna let some of the sound waves, more of the sound waves head our way and just spread out in every direction. All right. Now, you don't have to kill it right now because we're all here, but I want to really make sure that you're going to do a, a quick smash and then spread out. We need to be able to see a lot of movement from you, from you and your symbols when uh, we're way over there. So show everybody what you're going to do so that they know what to do. Kind of a pre-observation observation. observation. It's not going to be that loud when we're way over there, but we need it to be loud so that we do hear it and we need it to be dramatic so that we can see the motion, okay? Because what you guys might not realize is you're really observing two different types of waves right now. The most obvious one is which type of wave? Sound. 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 But what you might not realize, yeah, you're also <laughs> seeing this stuff happen. So you're seeing light waves. The rest of us are going to take a walk in a second. First, got to turn off the camera. Woo! <laughs> All right, so what we got on the camcorder now is a really, really hazy view of those two guys. I'm not going to say go. I'm just going to go three, two, one, and then you hit the go. So let's do that one more time. Three, <laughs> two, one. Oh. It's delayed. <laughs> that is so what we want, and everyone is all going over here. Wait, that is so delayed, which is exactly the point. You're a physics wizard, just so you know. <laughs> That's right. This is the observation that you guys might not have ever thought about. Eh? We're starting to make the observations that some of you have never made before. I'm just repeating myself because you might not have heard is that the, the first satellite time. like bringing the message to eight or something? No. The satellite? No. The wave no. coming to us late. It has to bounce off. All right, now here's what I want you to do the next time. I don't want to answer any questions yet. I'm just talking to Nikita. I don't want to answer too many questions now because that's the whole idea. I want you guys to be pissed off and confused right now. That's the idea. It's called learning. Okay? Here's what I got to do this time. I'm going to have to turn off my send button. Antoine, I'm going to start counting down like five, four, three, and then you're going to push the talk button, keep doing the countdown, and have Steven do the cymbal crash. Does that make sense? All right, thanks, <laughs> All right we're going to practice here. I'm going to do five, four, three, then I'm going to let go of the button, and you're going to do two, one, crash. That's right. You ready? I'll take that as a yes. All right, here we go. I'll give you more than just a few. You're going to do the three, two, one while you have the button push. Ready? Seven, six, five, four. <laughs> You're not just supposed to say crash. That crash is supposed to be Steven actually crashing. Here we go again. Seven, six, five, four. That's, a, that's actually a pretty cool delay. Keep the button pressed while he's crashing. I want to hear the crash through the radio. He got scared. <laughs> All right, one more time here for practice, and then we're going to do this for real. Seven, six, five, four. I love you guys, you're doing great. <laughs>